Thank you, Bobby. Can everybody hear me all right? That's a great question to ask when you have a fine system like this, amplification, but you have to speak over all this work going on behind us, all the beeping. I've been watching those doors going by. And I don't mind having to speak over a new BMW getting produced and rolling off at roughly every minute. New, that's a, that's a great thing. I like to start off with something funny. Y'all, if you heard the little story about the fellow in the church, they're in the big church, a lot of churches in South Carolina. In fact, I think we, we got a, we got a we hold the world's record. When Peggy and I go to our place, family place down in Paulie's Island, we like to go to. One time I noticed all the, the churches and some synagogues, a lot of churches, so I counted them. You can see 85 churches from the road in 137 miles between Columbia and the way we go to Pauley's Island, which is on the coast. That's a, that's a strong statement. Also a strong statement of our military tradition. Those are two things in addition to what Bobby mentioned that made us such a great place to do business and work with. A little funny story, the uh, fellow was, was at the end of the church service, big church service, and helping people out. He was walking out helping an older lady down the front steps of his big church. And he says, uh, ma'am, I got to just say, that's about the worst sermon I think I ever heard. She said, hmm, you don't know who I am, do you? He says, no, I don't. He says, well, I'm the preacher's mama. He said, oh, well, you don't know who I am, do you? He said, no, I don't. He said, thank you, Jesus. <laughs> well, see, everybody here in this state knows everybody. 1994 was a big year, New. It was a big year politically for South Carolina. Where was the Speaker of the House? It was the first Speaker, Republican Speaker of the House in the South in 1994. Stand up and take a, take a bow. Since reconstruction, David Wilkins, now Ambassador. <laughs> Where's David, where David Rip go? He was, here, he was here at the beginning on the county camp. Stand up and take a bow. <laughs> and I want to thank the other members of the legislature put in their time and work. The county council, the legislative delegation, used to be uh, maybe a house member, uh, like uh, White Loftus, now so if y'all stand up and take a bow. Let them look at you. That's a good looking bunch. Mike Burns, Bill Tumley on the back row. But my point is we got a great team, and it takes a great team to have this kind of success, and we're gonna keep on doing it. Frankly, I wonder why anybody, any big company would want to go anywhere but the South because of all the things we have here. It takes a lot of work. I remember a chairman of BMW a few years ago at a ceremony like this said, we came to South Carolina because South Carolina is a handshake state. He says, when the people of South Carolina give you their word, they'll keep it and they'll work. Mark Clark, great general, youngest four-star general in the history of this country, once said that there's more patriotism per square inch in South Carolina than any place in the world. Now you take that kind of people with those kind of traditions and put them in a place called paradise with the mountains and the rivers and the oceans and all the things, the climate, all the things that we have, and you produce, you produce some strong people. And strong people produce success. And that is what we are seeing here today, and we're seeing it all over our state, and we're going to keep on seeing it, because we got the right attitude, we got the right team, we got the right people. And new finally, to answer your question, have you delivered, has BMW delivered on its expectations, on our expectations? The answer is yes. With, it started off the promises, I remember, uh, Mr. Ambassador David, Brit, uh, 600 million was the promise and 2,000 employees. Well now we're at 10 billion in investment or more and 11,000 employees through five expansions with 4.75 million vehicles and one coming off every minute. That's why this, these things keep moving behind me. In any way you look at it, that is success. And we're gonna have more of it. I, my final thought is, for all, all of us here, we, we are in a position, we have seen this success, we know what makes people happy, we know what makes people strong, and the thing that we must do is be sure that the children and the young people of our state are fully educated. Where, where's Dr. From 
Technical College. Where's Dr. Miller? The, that is one another reason for our great success. We got to educate these children. We got to train them. We have to be sure that they have high expectations and allowed and encouraged to go to their fullest dreams. And it will be done because of places like this, because of efforts like this, because of this kind of teamwork. So ladies and gentlemen, always tell the children of South Carolina that South Carolina is the best place in the world to live, work, and raise a family, right here. And thank you, thank you BMW, thank you this great team for this very successful moment, and there will be more, we promise. This is a license plate commemorating 25 years of production in South Carolina, September 30, 2019. It says BMW uh, 2025, and it also bears our motto, while I breathe, I hope we are breathing. We are hoping for 25 more years at least, at least, and so on behalf of about five million proud, happy South Carolinians, we present this to you in commemoration of this event and this success.